Yes, it's uh, kind of funny because uh, my whole family is a football soccer family. Uh, my father used to be a soccer player, a football player for Pauk in the 90s and 90s. And uh, my brother now is actually playing for, for Aik. It's a funny story because I started playing uh, football when I was young too. And in the age around uh, 10, 11, I decided uh, this sport is not for me. I, I remember uh, uh, very intensely that uh, I was in my room. I had uh, in my room like uh, five or six footballs, you know, uh, soccer balls, and uh, I threw them all to my to my younger brother. And I told him, I told him, uh, Simos, my younger brother, uh, this is for you. I'm done. I'm done with soccer. I'm done with football. Uh, it's time for me to change sport. So uh, I decided to play basketball. I, I fell in love with the sport, and uh, the story continues. For sure, being born in Thessaloniki has been very important because Thessaloniki is well known uh, in basketball history. Uh, it has three great te basketball teams, uh, which uh, out of them, Pau Canaris, uh, are very famous. So, being born in Thessaloniki played a huge role uh, and, become a, and I became a basketball fan. I started playing in, a, in an academy uh, called uh, AC Asteria. So uh, the coach over there, it's coach Ted Rodopoulos, which uh, had taught me the basics of basketball and uh, he taught me a lot of outside the court and inside the court, of course. Uh, and he basically is the one who created the idea to move in the States and uh, he, uh, the, all the American mentality. And I, for sure, I owe a lot to him. Uh, I will never forget about him. So he's the reason basically why I love America and why I had to make this important step uh, for America. It was a small city, but uh, you know, playing uh, in a great university like Wake Forest was an amazing experience. The the students over there they love the ba they love basketball. They uh, they're dedicated to it. Uh, also, I was uh, honored and blessed to to be part of a great basketball team. Coach Manning was there my experiences that I gained from uh, all this uh, uh, experience was amazing. Uh, I, I was really blessed and I will never forget about it. I also chose Wake Forest because it's a legend legendary school. Uh, uh, Tim Duncan, uh, Randolph Childress, uh, Chris Paul, Jeff Teague, all these great players. You know, you go to the practice facility and you see uh, in the walls, uh, all those players, uh, you get goosebumps basically. I remember, I remember very much that uh, I, in the first practice, I go to the practice facility when I visited too, and I saw Tim Duncan on the big wall, and it uh, was something I will never forget. JC, John uh, JC is an amazing, amazing player, amazing guy, one of the best teammates I actually have ever had. He's, uh, I remember since uh, we were. Uh, in college, he, he used to work very hard, he is very athletic, he, he has evolved his game and I'm very happy for his career. I mean, uh, and I, continue, I, I wish him to continue to do great. Being not able to test the NBA waters that period of time was something different because uh, when I came to, to Greece after my, uh, for my family break and for the national team break, uh, the national team, when I was 20, 21, called me. So uh, after this, Panathinaikos and Olympiakos automatically draw interest in me and uh, I had to make a decision. Uh, that was either uh, I will continue my career uh, in college uh, as my senior year and um, to, to test the NBA waters or I should uh, sign with a Greek team or go to the Euroleague. I decided to sign with Panathinaikos after this and uh, to play in the Euroleague too. To play, to play in Greece uh, in such a very famous uh, powerhouse like Panathinaikos, is, of course it was a great experience. Uh, to me, being also a Greek, it was also a privilege. I uh, had the, uh, the experience to face all these fans, uh, to face some great teammates, some great personalities, uh, and I, I gained a lot of it. Uh, the decision to go to Milan was uh, um, to go. Uh, Coach Messina helped me a lot in this decision. You know, um, 
it has a great we have uh, in this team great uh, teammates uh, great players uh, we have a lot of expectations I wanted to make this step and uh, for then, then to move on to the next chapter of my career and uh, the rest uh, we'll see on the court and uh, we hope uh, we'll have a good year too. For sure, coach can use me as a four and five position, but uh, I think and I like playing a, a lot of the four. I actually enjoy it too, so I'll, I'll answer the four. Yes, uh, that's the goal to become uh, very stable in the three point shot, uh, per, especially percentage wise. You have to be in a specific uh, number. Um, every day is a new challenge, it's uh, an opportunity to get better. So. As long as uh, we're blessed, everybody, each player on the team to work uh, in their game, I'll continue to do the same.